In this quick lesson, I'm going to show you how to use this alignment tab from the Align Space and Distribute tools in the Design Center here. So we want to align all these objects with each other. So to do that, we draw a marquee over them, and you'll see these buttons highlight on the right-hand side here. And when I hover my mouse over these buttons, I see a preview of how the objects will align with each other. I can simply just click on the one I want out of any of them, and the objects will automatically align, as you can see there. Now sometimes you want to align objects to a particular object. And the way to do that is to click Align to Last Selected. So what you do is you click on the objects that you want to align to another object by holding down the Shift key. And then you come over here and check this button, check this checkbox I should say, and hover your mouse over the alignment you're interested in. As you can see here, all of these show you a preview. And again, we'll select the center here. And you can see all the objects have aligned to their last selected object. So that's how Align to Last Selected Object works. Now, on this next page here, I'll show you how to align to the center or align objects that are all ungrouped. So all of these are separate objects. So if I draw a marquee over this in alignment, you can see here that's not the result we're looking for. We want to align these as a group. So you'll see this set of options here, Align as a Group, and again you get a preview, as you can see. And you simply click on the one you're interested in. And even though all these objects are ungrouped, if you use that particular Align as Group function there, option, you'll find they will all align together as a temporary group and be ready to go. So that's the end of this lesson.